I want to speak about two sets of tires that we normally use um, at with our 110 skills uh, touring or dry cars. One is the BSR recent tire and the other it's a sweep recent F1 type tire. I saw them and I decided I wanted to see exactly what they are all about, how would they look in terms of um, making that car look a little beast like or beefy. So I decided to explore and see what they look like. Well, I'm not disappointed with either of them, but what I can say is that with the BSR recent tires, they come in various size. And this one in particular, it's uh, 32 millimeter wide, and it's for the 35, it's 35 inch um, dragon diameter. Now, the, it's the model, or let's see if you can see it here. So, it's the BSR F4525D. This one is um, 32 millimeter, and this one is 45. And obviously, you can see in both of them, one is wider than the other. So a little information on this one here. It's it's a wide foam um, tire, 38 show drag carbon wheel. Now this this is a pack of two BSR for one scale, 110 scale. And um, they, these tires they come mounted on black wheels. The hex is 12 millimeters so which means it's a lot easier to fit on the um, the small scales okay um, there is not much needed to in terms of installation it's just a matter of um, changing whatever 12 millimeter tire that you have and um, replace it now like i said this is 45 so it's a bit wide mostly depending on the type of vehicle you have type of car you have you will want to put it into the rear and um, this one here it's a bit smaller 32 so obviously it's going to go to the front now this one I also saw and I was a bit sort of curious as to what this tire is all about it looks really nice I'm going to open it in a while but from based on the description that I was told it's um the brand is sweep f1 exp pre-mounted um rubber tires and it's 14 millimeter in terms of hex so it's a low profile tire design according to f1 regulation which is rather interesting the x the ex compound red tires are made for both asphalt and carpet which is the same like this yeah and it's measured 6 to 1.5 millimeter in diameter. So these tires, um, they are pre-glued on rock hard um, wheels. Now in terms of the width, earlier on you said this is 35 and this is 45, but the width um, as the specification, the specification, it says that um, it is 40 millimeters. So which means it will be a little less than than this one yeah so it's good for slick if you want to you know run some slick tires now like i said these are for 110 and i also have some pro lines tires on the side here and when you do a comparison <laughs> you can see how how big they are so what i can do uh let's open up and have a closer look and see what what they look like one has to be very careful when you open up this package. Like the instruction says, very foam. Wow, good for reason. So we are going to open up these here. Those are the, yeah, it's nice. It is glue onto the wheel itself. Really nice. Uh, let's see what the um, 45 millimeter Look and let's do a comparison. 
the wonton scales have some nice wheels but sometimes when you put on white as it gives that car that extra look extra beast like aggressive look oh, this is really wide compared to um, the normal tires that we will use okay so these are the um, the BSR I think it's really nice and um, let's go over to the others here and do a comparison nice packaging um, and of course you you do get um, some what is this is some stickers yeah sweet so you can add this to your recent car these decals let's open up the others What I can tell you from from feeling them, it's it's really sticky. That's the first thing that I notice. It's really sticky compared to these here. But one thing for sure, they both have grips. So when you do a comparison in terms of size, of course the forty five is um, wider, and um, if you look at the circumference yes these are a lot wider than the sweep tires so i'll have to figure out exactly what what um machine i'm going to put these on to but so far like i said they look really good i have to modify those bad boys so most likely I'll be putting those tires onto it. Now, earlier on I said that um, these are um, 14 hex. Oh yes, when you do, when you look at it, you can see definitely um, it's bigger. So we can run this on 14 millimeter. However, if you're going to use the 12 millimeter, you will have to get um, an adapter. On eBay, you can get the hex adapter, which I... I have a few lying around and um, you can easily so these are um, 14 to um, 12 millimeters so it's a conversion so you put it in it should be easily slipping what up and then you automatically becomes 12 millimeter so you can definitely run them on these bad boys so what we will do now, we will um, step aside and offer them up and see how they fit in into these machines. Remember, keep following the channel. In that way, you will see the outcome as to how they look and um, whether it makes a difference or not. Thank you once again for viewing and please don't forget to share and even subscribe. This information goes a long way because in the RC world, in the RC business or RC group, whatever you may call it, we want to share the information with each other because sometimes we are in a position or in a decision to make and we need a little more clarity on it. So I do hope that this information is a bit clear. So in case of a future purchase, you will know what to buy and what to expect.